This is Lummy, and you're watching Dreadfully Drawn. Live! Today I'm going to draw Jurgen Klopp, the Liverpool manager. So firstly, when I draw people, I normally start with the, the, the head shape, because then from there you can get the ears and all the facial features and the hair and stuff. So that's what I normally do, so I'll, I'll do that now. Jurgen's got quite a round head. It's quite... He's got quite a long head, as if, you know, without being insulting. So if I do his hair, then that means I can do the ears as well. Because once you've, once you've done the ears, I, I tend to do the, the, the head shape and the ears first, because once you've done the ears, then you can work with the eyes and the nose and the mouth and you can position them properly. So I'll add a bit of detail to the hair. Right. Next is a very recognisable part of Jürgen, his mouth. You've got to get this right. If this isn't right, then, then I don't know, the drawing probably won't be as good as you, it probably could be. If you mess the mouth up, then I'll probably start again, to be honest. I'm happy with that, that'll do. Next is the nose. The, the eyes I find are the most difficult part of drawing someone. Um, I think it's make or break if you, if you get the eyes wrong, but if you do all the stuff around the eyes well, then you can sort of blag, you can blag the eyes to be honest, I think. It looks more like Carlo Ancelotti at the minute, but the eyes will be a pivotal part. His eyes are quite far apart, Jürgen. He's got quite big eyes, to be fair. And uh, this is a risky one. Right, not bad, not bad. He's got quite big eyelids as well. His eyes are quite a key feature of his face and more so than other people. Draw some eye, eye bags under, get the crow's feet in. Now, at the minute, it doesn't look like him. It does not look like him. But the beard is a massive part of Jürgen and the way he looks. So, I'm hoping that this, this makes it look like him. I'm not confident though, but we'll try it. It's strange how much a beard can save a drawn actually, because when it doesn't look like it's going the way you want it to, adding a bit of Facial hair can really help the drawing. I mean, it's not great. Draw his lip. He hasn't got a very big top lip, but. <laughs> Get uh, the, the wrinkles in on the top of his head. And then we'll go for. What, what, I don't know what to put on him. I'll, I'll do his jacket that he's got on here. It's not, it's not like an iconic bit of clothing that Jürgen wears. I haven't really seen him wear these kind of jackets that much, but they're easy to draw, so. And then once the rough drawing's done, I normally just look over and see if there's anything I've missed, like his eyelashes. He's got, he's got quite long eyelashes, Jürgen. I mean, I'm quite happy with that. I'm quite happy with that. And there you have it. I mean, it doesn't look too much like him, but if you put it in Photoshop and add a bit of colour and change a couple of lines, it'll look like him. It'll look like him.
So that was how I would draw Jurgen Klopp. I would take that into Photoshop now. If I was to post it anywhere, I would put it into Photoshop. I wouldn't do another one. I'm happy with that. That'll do. That was how I draw Jurgen Klopp. Thank you for watching. If you liked it, subscribe. Goodbye.